Hello, I don't do a lot of videos, and even less with me in them, but people ask me about the waters I use over winter here on the farm, and, well, that's them, or one of them, that's a 30 gallon, just plastic drum, I believe that one had, I don't know, dish detergent or bleach in it at one time. It, I've been using that one for about 10 years now and it does a good job the pigs figure out the nipples and see just regular old standard pig nipples and I take uh, black pipe fittings and put on the back with uh, 90 degree downturns so they get as much water out as there as they can if it gets low a lot of times I put a auto water up here, just a float valve, and as they drain it, water goes back in. I haven't got, I can't do that over the winter, it freezes up. But in over winter, I drop a, just a stock tank heater in there, and it keeps it thawed out all winter long. And it plugs in right over here, just the opposite side. These guys were just cut yesterday the boys were anyway and they'll be in this pen for about a week healing up and making sure they don't get any infection and everything goes well with that but pretty nice little group of pigs it's not the most giant of pens and this is why they're in that pen summertime when there's not a lot of mud I just let them out right back out after they're cut but too much chance for infection getting that mud up in there and the incisions and out there they grad well they'll have this whole pen back in a week after that I open those gates out there up and they get full run of the pasture. I'm not walking through all that mud in my tennis shoes. I guess I can go around this way. My winter water system's a little different. I was digging a trench. I, well, I did intentionally, but cut the water lines that come down here. So I can't just water out of the hose anymore. I gotta go back to my old water tank contraption until I get a water line trench down the road to the hydrants again. That's pretty basic setup. That's, I think that's a 350 gallon tank. And back in the days when I had the landscape company, I did a lot of ornamental ponds, so I kept uh, water pumps in stock. Don't have much use for the 15 gallon per minute ones, but the 175 gallon per minute ones run some water and just barely fit in the water tank hole so I can pump the water right out and into the water here's where the store used to be for folks that have been here it's since moved Anyway, these little guys, there's the back of the building and the door I was looking out. They move to this pen next, and then we move over to this pen, which goes way, I don't know, it's about, probably right at an acre of just different grasses and weeds and all the tomatoes that I feed to the big pigs over the fence up there, worse, the seeds worse down here and they tend to sprout and we get wild tomatoes growing out here. 